about to witness the first evangelical profession of our nine brothers in the congregation of missionary sons of the Immaculate Heart of the Blessed Virgin Mary, commonly known as Claritian Missionaries. Moreover, our community with the families of our brothers who are to profess this morning would like to express our deepest gratitude for gracing this momentous event with your presence. At first, the call of the Lord seemed to be unclear, yet the nine of them, Brother Alvin L. Arcete, Brother Sandy L. Bahia Jr., Brother Joe Stephen C. Cagaana, Brother Joseph Ngo Van Lam, Brother Stephen Nguyen Van Nam, Brother Peter Nguyen Doc Heng, Brother Ronel John P. Ricomuno, Brother Kevin Mark R. Rendon, and Brother Jan Baptist Tran Bin Hua, risk in faith and trust to respond to the Lord's invitation to this vocation to religious life in the Claritian way. In their willingness to respond when they heard the Lord saying to them, in the deepest aspirations of their hearts, Come follow me, I will make you fishers of men. They left behind their nets, families, personal dreams and aspirations, possessions and other possibilities of life that await them in the future. In so doing, our congregation, after several years of formation, has found them ready and able to fully embrace the faculty and responsibilities of a missionary living in poverty, chastity, and obedience. Moreover, in the course of their formation, especially in the novitiate, each of them has realized that their lives must be firmly rooted to Jesus, the one who called them. The nine of them set an example for each of us today, that we, as called to be disciples, must remain with Jesus and must bear fruit. Our faithfulness and fruitfulness only rest on the firmness of our connection to the source of our faith, hope, and love. Brother Albin Ligados Arcete was born on the 10th of July in the year 1989. He was born from a family with four children of Mr. Henry Arcete and Mrs. Cecilia Arcete of the Pulog City. In the month of May of 2006, this beloved brother of ours was one of the freshmen who entered the Claret College Seminary and later on would make it to graduation, postulancy, novitiate, and finally to the first evangelical profession. Alvin has exemplified all throughout his formation process in humility and meekness. Often caught in silence, this proved his deep way of thinking, musing, and praying. In May of 2009, another person who has an admirable talent in music joined the community in the person of Brother Sandy Labalan Bahie Jr. from Legazpi City, Albay, Bicol. He was born on January 2, 1989. This brother is the third among the eight children of Mr. Sandy Bahia Sr. and Mrs. Flitia Bahia. He graduated with a degree of Bachelor in Communication Arts major in Journalism from Bicol University in March 2009. His talents and skills are not only limited in music. Sandy also bears the mighty pen in his hand as a writer, composer, and as a cartoonist. All of these God-given gifts are all for the greater glory of God in Sandy's missions. It was the 25th day of April in 1980 when Brother Joe Stephen Cesar Cagaanan was born to the family of Mr. Fermin Cagaanan and Mrs. Cirilla Cagaanan. He is the eldest of the three children their beloved and respected parents have, commonly known as Sano. This true Buholano grew up in Dwight. In March 2004, he obtained his college degree in Bachelor of Science Customs Administration from the University of Bohol. Always carrying a smile in his face, this brother of ours has been near and special to the heart of everyone, especially to those people in the apostolate areas he was serving. This attitude a lighter and positive heart and mind toward life really helps a future missionary make his life worth living.
The Philippine province of Claritian missionaries is blessed to have seminarians from Vietnam. As a sign of growing number in vocation, Vietnam community has sent several students to undergo formation here in the Philippines. One of those is Brother Joseph Ngo Ban Lam, who arrived in the country in 2009. He was given birth on August 25, 1979, by Mrs. Mary Nguyen Tilbua, wife of Mr. Joseph Ngo Van Loy. He is also the eldest among the six children the family has. Joseph obtained his college degree in Bachelor of Arts, English, Linguistic, and Literature in the year 2006 from University of Social Sciences and Humanities. Prior to the year of his graduation in 2005, he entered the Scholarian Missionaries in Vietnam. Noted as a Vietnamese and an alien to the Philippines, this brother expressed his desire and willingness to undergo a missionary formation. He is shown to carry a tongue of a missionary, learning and speaking a new language new to all Vietnamese. Born to the family of Mr. Anthony Nguyen Van Long and the late Mrs. Mary Tran Thi Sam, brother Stephen Nguyen Van Nam opened his eyes to see the world. On December 26, 1979, he was given birth and became the fifth child among the eight children the family has. From Vin University, he earned his degree in mathematics of computer in 2004. A year after, he entered the congregation in Vietnam and studied philosophy under the guidance and supervision of the Jesuits in St. Joseph Scholastica. This brother of ours expressed his deep love and inclination to liturgy after serving as a knight of the altar several years back then in Vietnam. The community has been blessed also with some people who have deep preference in arrangements, physical measures, and nature. And so is brother Peter Nguyen Du Kien. He was born on the 8th day of January 1979. Counting himself as the ninth child among the twelve siblings of Mr. Joseph Nguyen Rong and Mrs. Mary Nguyen T. Kim Lien, his parents. In the year 2004, Peter graduated from Thai Nguyen University with a degree on agriculture. One would see this brother of ours planting and taking care of the plants in the same way that he nurtured the seed of his vocation. A brother from Cotabato City, Brother Ronel John Patrocinio Ricomono, was born on May 9, 1990, as the first child among the three of Mr. Ronilio Ricomono and Mrs. Pilita Ricomono. He stayed in St. Anthony Mary Claret College since the summer program of 2006 up to 2010 when he finally gained his degree on Bachelor of Arts in Philosophy. Like many seminarians, he has conveyed his deep inclination in sports as an important sign of fondness to have a healthy body as a missionary. A man of commendable leadership, Brother Kevin Mark Rivivar Indoor, served as the coordinator of the Central Coordinating Committee of Claret Seminary in 2009 and served as the Student Council President of St. Anthony Mary Claret College in 2010 where he also obtained from his degree on Bachelor of Arts in Philosophy as Magna Cum Laude. This brother of ours was born on the 20th day of October 1989. Kevin is the first of the two sons of the late Raul R. Rindor Sr. and Mrs. Maria Vivian B. Vivar. As a leader, with an utmost concern for his brothers, he joyfully accepted the task to drive for the community making himself available every time his service is in great need. Brother John the Baptist Tran Vinh Moa, born on August 7, 1975, in a citizen of Vietnam, is the fifth son among the eight children of Mr. Joseph Tran Ban Mo and Mrs. Anna Tran Tila. He acquired his college degree from Kanto University in 2002 with a degree on food technology. Three years later, in 2005, he decided to enter into the Claritian missionaries in Vietnam. As a future missionary, 
JB, as he is commonly known and called, exemplified in practicing and living the true spirit of a man, ready to be sent everywhere by staying with the people to know their situation and aspirations. The branch cannot bear fruit by itself but has to remain part of the vine. The same is true with our nine brothers who will swear to the Lord and to his people that they will generously offer their lives for the mission. Let us pray for them therefore, for the gift of fidelity and perseverance, as the pages of their lives continue to unfold as young Claritian missionaries impelled by God's love.